Once upon a time, there was a priest named Kamalo, who had two sons, who were very obedient. Kamalo worked for the high chief Koopa, and they all lived on the island of Molokai. Inside Koopa's temple, there are two sacred drums that he plays to communicate with his priests. One day, he left, and Kamalo's sons were overcome by their temptations and beat the drums. Boom! Boom! When Koopa returned, he was enraged that they had beaten his drums. As punishment, he killed Kamalo's sons. When Kamalo found out that his sons were dead, he set out for revenge. He asked the prophets to help, but they denied him. So he went to find the shark god, Kahuhu. When Kamalo reaches the island of the shark god, the guard tells him he must do three tasks in order to meet Kahuhu. Kamalo has to gather a special plant from an island and catch a large tuna from the depths of the ocean. Once Kamalo gathered his items, he hides behind the plant to wait for the shark god, who he tells his story to. Kahuhu agrees to help Kamalo. After a long time waiting for Kahuhu, the god finally sends a storm that washes away Koopa, the chief, and all of his people. Meanwhile, Kamalo and his people are safe from the storm, and Kamalo finally gets his revenge. Kamalo and his people are forever safe behind the sacred fence they built for Kahuhu, the shark god. They renamed the harbor where Koopa's people died, Akanaka, or man-eater, for the sharks that ate them. <laughs>